Hello everyone, welcome to Poetically Christian and welcome to another edition of Christian Couple Play. My name is Derek. And I'm Brandy. And we thank you so much for choosing to see another edition of CCP. Today we're continuing on with another edition of House Flippa. And today is a very special day because today is the finale of the Home Alone series. Yes, if you've missed any of these, check out our playlist on Poetically Christian YouTube, Christian Couple Play House Flipper. I believe we have an entire Home Alone series. This is the sixth and final episode. We're going to finish the McAllister home and we're going to flip. We're going to do this. Mm-hmm. <laughs> we're going to do we're gonna this. We're going to do thing. our best. <laughs> do our best to finish this today. Before we get to our gameplay, as usual, guys, we're going to go with the verse that fits our play today. And going along with this, so you know, in House Flipper, your whole thing is to see if you can make it more appealing to men and women who want to buy the house so you can flip it. Material things are what matters to them, what's in the home, and how much money they'll give to it. But in our life, that's not what matters most to us, is it? No, Paul tells us in God's Word, the Bible, in Colossians chapter 3 and verse 2, that as Christians, we are to set our affections on things above and not on things of the earth. Yes, in this life, it's okay to enjoy things. It's okay to like things. It's okay to appreciate material things. But those shouldn't be what matter most to us as a Christian, should it? No, in our life, God matters most. Our affections, our passion, what we love the most should be above. That's what we should love. And it should not be the things of this earth because they have no worth. Yes, when this life is over, what good would it do us if we gained everything but we lose our own soul? So in this life, set your affections on things above and not on things of the earth. And we'll have a heavenly home waiting for us, guys. With that being said, let's do this. Okay. (laughs) So I'm looking at this here, and they have been showing us the um, house flipper wish list it now the house, oh, flipper two. house flipper two but now wait farm flipper oh wow they're expanding out <laughs> it's 4 13 2023 it's oh this to come pretty out. soon april 13th as of recording this guys <laughs> yeah <laughs> get ready for farm flipper <laughs> they're going they're going ham on this thing <laughs> apparently there's a quite a following for it yeah Thank you guys for being part of the safe zone for God's own. We appreciate you being with us for this finale of the McAllister home here. Got, got my a, notes. Yep, she's got her cheat sheet again, guys. And just so you guys know, I did do a little bit of work off stream. Just a wee little bit. So you guys can get it. Um, you can see it. I'll review what we did. Yeah, while... just a little bit of what wallpaper and... Yeah, some wallpaper and some painting and yeah. key things like that. Um, so in the bathroom, I did a couple things for the kids' bathroom. So I'll show when we get there here. I'll show you a few things that I did. All right, go to the gate and off to our winter wonderland. Yep, go to alone home. All right, <laughs> and just like that, we go from summer to winter or spring to winter. We uh um on the on the uh off stream i also played some side jobs so i do have a little bit more money than i had before but that was just some you know side jobs that i i did off stream they were christmas jobs too i I figured nobody wanted to watch more christmas (laughs) not now (laughs) oh yeah we meant to have this done by new year's but that life happens yes it does Uh, we just have to accept it this guy's crazy. He says he wants two baths to bathe in cold and hot water simultaneously. <laughs> I think that's impossible. You that can't be uh, hot is beyond and cold at the same uh, a time. want and more like a fetish. It's called a warm bath at yeah. that point. So you know a little no. We'll do the final walkthrough. Yeah. Uh, when we're done. Yeah. But we're almost there. It's gonna be bittersweet <gasps> to see the yes. McAllister house get flipped here, guys. All right. So. I did add the tables in the hallways with the flowers, like the pots that she had. Yeah. Now, here's Kevin's room. Now, Kevin! his wall 
was uh, white with like a bunch of different colored circles. I had no wallpaper that matched that. So I went ahead and I kind of did this honeycomb shape. And then I did his bed with the red, because he did have red in his room. And I did red blinds and yep. kind of did a little bit, put his desk here. And, and we so. did tap down the haunted pen in Buzz's room. <laughs> I'm not sure if it's still floating. We'll see. Oh, uh, if you guys missed the last episode, we had a haunted pen that was flying around the room. <laughs> it went, it went that was crazy. Foot. So this is one of the girls' rooms. So I went ahead and I painted it a pale green and put up some uh, blinds for her. So I did do that because it was just plain yeah. uh, white in there. All right, here's Buzz's room. Now Buzz's room was not exactly like this. We kind of had to modify it some, um, but you know, we have to make do because- Yeah, they didn't have stripes vertically, so no. we had to use horizontal. Yeah, we did horizontal waves. Yeah. Now, we said we were gonna leave Jeff's room plain. Yep. But I didn't feel right. I had a guilty conscience. <laughs> I had to make the boy have a real room. So I gave him this humongous mirror to make it look like he's got more space. I gave him a dart board so he can take out his frustrations. <laughs> and I gave him a little end table. You can see he's got a little lamp. Put up some curtains, yeah. an alarm clock, some books, and it says, how you doing? <laughs> how you doing? How you doing? And I gave him a little bit of, uh, I don't know, kind of closet -y type thing, so he has a place for clothes. There you go. So he now has a room. It's official. It's official. It's official. I didn't even take a shortcut on his room. There you go. Now here's the bathroom. Now, technically, the bathtub is supposed to be a tub shower. But I couldn't make that work. For whatever reason, it, it was wouldn't recognize it. It was like the old call tub, like, yeah. Yeah, it wouldn't recognize it. Now, um, we did, there's supposed to be a pedestal sink, but I had to improvise because we don't have a pedestal sink. I did put <laughs> in the mirror because it didn't have a mirror in the bathroom. And I put in this plant because there was none smaller, but it looks very similar to okay. the one that was in the movie. So we kind of had to improvise a little bit which we've done a lot, and that's yeah. not really dirty, that's just permanent grunge forever. I can't <laughs> clean that off. Okay. Grungy. <laughs> and the wall, the wallpaper, or the, excuse me, the tile in the bathroom, it is green and white, and I think there was some black in there too, but um, I couldn't choose anything any different, so we're gonna leave it with that. Yeah. Okay, so here's the other little girl's room. I did hers in orange. Kind of similar to the other girls. Hers was green. This one's orange. This is Lenny's room? or Yeah. We can call that Lenny's. That's fine. All right. Now, here's the mom and dad's room. Yeah, we got to do this one. Okay. So, I did not do anything in the mom and dad's room. The only thing I did in here was sell the bookshelves yeah. that were in here. So, I can make us a bathroom. So, we have another bathroom upstairs. Because with this many people, you've got to have another bathroom. Only a wimp would be hiding under the bed. <laughs> <laughs> and I can't be a wimp. I'm the man of the house. Okay. So, I'm going to make the bed and make it look a little bit neater. Now, uh, technically, the parents' room did have a four-poster bed. Is there popcorn or what was it? Cracker crumbs where he was jumping on the bed eating? We already cleaned that stuff up. <laughs> we already cleaned everything up uh... earlier. So, um, they technically had a four-poster bed, but I don't think we have an option for red um, bedspread on a four-poster bed. But I am going to look just to see. That's crazy. So, you can get a four-poster bed, but you just can't have it be a red bedspread. I don't know. I'm going to check and see. Wow, that's a lot of... That's rhymes. I'm a poet and did know it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you are a poet. <laughs> red bedspread. I like um, it. Okay, let's see here. That was actually hard to say. <laughs> I do not doubt that. Oops, didn't mean to make that go away. All right. Yeah, let us know, guys. Or have you enjoyed this series? And is it going to be bittersweet for you to see it go? But we always got the next house, whatever. Will we be on the moon? As Charlie Brown oh, kick that foot out of the moon. So this four poster bed has the curtains around it. These ones do. This one, I'm looking for a four poster that doesn't have the curtains. That's what I think maybe, maybe that was the problem. Yeah, uh, okay. <laughs> it's kind of a sort of like a four poster, but it's not full. Um, 
it does have the posts. Uh -huh. So, but I don't want to pay over a thousand dollars for that bed. Wow. Uh, what are these? Those are like almost a thousand. All right, they're sticking with the bed they got. I've dumped a ton of money into this house. <laughs> <laughs> we can make the exception. It's good enough. Okay, so um, now we do have the fireplace that is there. Um, we do need to get a TV. Yep. So they did have an old-fashioned TV in here. Guests stay at the world-renowned Plaza Hotel. Yeah, it was he's on watching the TV. the TV. Yeah, I don't know. Is it in decorations? I'm thinking. Oh yeah, that's right. I can do a search for yes. it. Yes. We figured that out. We did. We're going to try TV and see if it works. It's wall mounted. There's a TV remote. TV electronic. Um, that's not quite. But we know it's an entertainment. So we can go in entertainment and see if maybe. Gotta be a telly. Electronic equipment, entertainment, TVs and speakers. There you go. Ah. Well, they yeah, got back in the day before the flat screens. Mm-hmm. When we had the old uh, box style. And boy, did those things have some weight to them. They have a phone. Um, so I think they had something. Hang up the phone and make me, why don't you? <laughs> I'll go ahead and buy her a phone. We're going to do white. Could you imagine saying that to your mom? No. Oh, my goodness. If I mm -hmm. had said that to my mom, that would not have been pretty. That wouldn't have gone over well at all. No. So there is supposed to be a, um, a end table or nightstand on this side, too. But the room's not big enough. You need the alarm clock, though. So, yeah. So I'm putting a phone over here. We did it again. <laughs> yes, I am going to put the alarm clock. Yeah, now here's the ultimate trivia question. What time did it go off? Mm. That would be rough. I think it's probably different in each movie. It's probably different in the first and second one. Hmm. Why is it not going? It's green. Green means go. Yeah, green means I can buy it. <laughs> Red light, green light. It is a mystery. I am confused. It is amusing. There we go. Yay. Got it to finally. Well, I don't. I just. I just want to pick it up. There we go. Now will you let me move you? <laughs> <laughs> let me move you. There we go. All right. Let my people go. All right. So we've got the phone in here. And we need a alarm clock. I don't think they have a digital alarm clock. We're gonna keep looking for the oh, old-fashioned TV. For real? I don't know if they do. That's so crazy. I was meaning. Um, not sure if they have that or not. Okay. Back. This is really cool, though. <laughs> the, the fact that we've done this. Hey, hey, we can always watch this during Christmas. Yes. And go back and you know every Christmas watch this series and see it. That's kind of cool. Well, we got DVD. We've got computer equipment, monitors. You would think there would be an old-fashioned. They have a router. A router. A mouse pad. Oh my goodness. They have a CRT monitor. Yeah, that's it. CRT. That's but an old television. It looks like a, but it looks like a computer monitor. Oh, okay. Like a CRT computer monitor rather than uh, an okay. old-fashioned. And I think it says old-fashioned TV. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, CRT is what you grew up playing your old uh, NES Genesis Super Nintendo on. Okay, so I can't remember if it's occasional or decorations. Remember, oh, yeah, small old TV. There you ha -ha. go. Ta-da. Okay. So we're going to put this TV over here. Come on. There we go. TV's there. Uh-huh. All right. Um, Got to get... 
plants. Let's see, these are all holiday stuff. Getting excited, guys. I wonder how much this thing's gonna go for. Oh, I hope, <laughs> I hope that it goes well. <laughs> we'll see. Um, will it be the sale of the century or will it be epic fail? <laughs> Either way, uh, you know, it's either been way, an it, it has been fun. This has been fun to recreate with all of you guys. We thank you for joining us on this crazy adventure. We got a little zealous probably doing this. I maybe a little bit, yeah. But, but that's uh, alright. You know, I haven't seen anybody else do anything like this, so it's kinda cool. Why not? It's a game. You can play it how you want sure. to. Sure. All right. Well, we're going to go with white. It's the closest we'll ever get to actually visiting the Home Alone house. So. <laughs> so she did have a plant by the Home Alone. Or by the Home Alone. Goodness gracious. By the uh, fireplace. And so I was trying to get that to work out here. But apparently, this is going to have to be a lot further out than I wanted it to be. So we're not going to go with that one. Yeah, be careful. If you guys have watched this series, you know that uh, nothing is small. <laughs> It's large. And in charge. So if you choose the uh, plant here, it might be Little Shop of Horrors. <laughs> Feed me. Feed me. Yeah, it gets adventurous, that's for sure. Um, so we need still the alarm clock, and we need the lamps, and the mannequin, and the window screen. That's mannequin? An awful lot. Yeah, because where she sews, like her sewing stuff. Oh. Mm -hmm. Dude, wouldn't that be like creepy in the middle of the night, wake up and see a... A mannequin in your room and I uh, think it's a real person standing there. So this is the best I have for alarm clock because they don't have a digital. The only other thing I could do, which I think I am going to do in this particular scenario, is go back to electronic equipment. And there's this here. It's, it's a boom fez radio, but it looks like it kind of maybe. I mean, it's probably supposed to be like a tape player, but we'll call it. We'll call it and say that that's it. I think theirs was white. That is crazy. So I'm gonna make But they don't white. have a digital alarm clock. They that. don't have a digital. They have a um like the old face yeah, clock. But yeah, but that won't work because then it won't go off. Right. And we need it to go off. There we go. Alright, so we've got our makeshift digital alarm clock. I don't mean to complain, but you guys give the worst <laughs> wake up call. <laughs> <laughs> Decorations, and I think I think it's in this section. Okay, we're looking. We're looking for. Hey, there's that Vlad the Impaler. <laughs> yeah. Oh my goodness, that episode was hilarious. You have to go back and check out Black yeah, Taylor later. Just check out this whole series. It's crazy. The stuff we've done is wild. We've definitely, definitely had our share of adventures. Yeah, several laughs along the way. Well, and I'm you've looking. had laughs with us. We've had folks in the chat. And... Yeah, they were laughing <laughs> with us. Yeah, it's been we an have adventure. laughs every time with you guys. Leave your comments on the YouTube videos, your chats here on Twitch. We love them. We have fun together as this Christian community. Here we go. Window screen. Okay. Yeah, I remember what color our window screen was. We'll go with something standard like that. Okay. All right, so we'll stick the window screen there. And then... I'm gonna check off my list. Sorry. <laughs> so the fireplace. She's the making red a list. Spread. She's checking it twice. <laughs> I'm taken off the list, actually. All right, we got the phone. I need the mannequin. I got the window screen. So I need the mannequin and the lamps. Even got the old-fashioned TV. All right, we're making tracks. All right, so we need. Well, let's see. I can't remember where the mannequin's at. Accessories. That might be it. <laughs> you know, because every side. house has a mannequin. Well, it's one of those <laughs> things like where you're 
making clothes and you put Oh, I get it. I, I, it definitely serves a purpose. I get it. It's just like, that would, that would take some getting used to. That would be intimidating. That, that would be, I agree. that would be creepy. Well, it, it's a headless mannequin if it makes uh, it any yeah. better, because it's not like it's going to be staring at oh, you. Oh, man. See? Uh, I get you. I, I totally get it. Yeah. I understand its purpose. I'm just saying that I think I'd be creeped out. Got a like mannequin. having a, you know, a clown in your room. Or... Okay, well, that would be pretty uncomfortable. <laughs> Wasn't just... there a movie once that had that, and uh, it was like a like a life-size clown or something? Yeah, that would be wild. That would be that would uh, That would be creepy. Okay, lights. Camera action. And we need... Uh, no, no wall lamps. Standing lamps? Yeah. Yeah, let us know, guys. What do you think? Table would you, lamps. would you be kind of creeped out if you had a mannequin in your bedroom? <laughs> you woke up in the middle of the night and saw that there. Well, maybe. That would be a little, a little scary. Of course, after a while, I guess it'd be like anything else. You'd maybe you'd get used to it. I was gonna say maybe it's not scary. Maybe it's just uncomfortable at first. Okay, I can't get this lamp to go. Hey, we did not see the 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 pen floating through the house, so <laughs> it must have uh, moved on. I don't know. I'll have to check Buzz's room a little closer. We did. We went see. in there. Yeah. All right. Well, there's supposed to be lamps on the bedside tables, and it's not happening very well. Sure. We'll put a lamp over here. She's gonna need a lamp to work. There. Ta-da. We're making it happen. There. Now she's got two lamps over here. Two lamps in the room, although they're not where they're supposed to be. But, you know, life happens. Yeah, this game just, uh, limitations. Yes. I'm stuck. There we go. Yeah, limitations. Could not get out of the room. I'm going to open up all the <laughs> doors stuck. so I can do the final walk through here shortly. I yep. do want to see if the pen's still stuck. It was under, it's you still, threw it under the desk. Well, it's next to the hockey stick now. Oh my gosh. Let's see if we can pick it up this time. It's haunted, guys. This thing is creepy. It, it was floating go. around the house. It won't. It will not. And you tried to throw it under the desk. Oh, and now oh. that you're back, it's with the Wait, hockey. Wait, look, see, it's green. So it looks like it should be under the de on the desk. Nope, it's under the desk. Like, it won't go on the desk. <laughs> we'll just leave it under the it's desk. It's possessed. It's crazy. It's got a mind of its own. Yeah. Okay. So now we're going in here and we're gonna make a bathroom. Is this the that... Uncle Frank? No, oh, Uncle that Frank was the bathroom's other one. the green one. Oh, okay. Yeah. So this one we essentially it's not actually shown in the movie, so we can kinda make this up however we want. And we can make them whatever colors we want. So this kinda gives us some liberty. It's some fun. Alright. So these are some unusual looking toilets and sinks. See, I was trying to get one of these, but it wouldn't work. So let's go ahead and get some Maybe you can make that happen in here. Mm, I don't think I have enough room. Uh. So we'll get a shower. I'm gonna get him a cheap shower. Okay. This one's really kind of a lot of clear, so that would probably make it work better. I just want to see if this is going to fit in where I want to put it. Okay. So are you going to fit? I need to turn you around like that. I don't think you're going to fit there. Are you going to fit there? It's going to be snug. You could do it. Maybe. We'll figure it out. All right, we'll make it happen. All right, let's see. We've got to purchase um, installations. There's installations. So we're going to have to, for assembly. Assembly. We're going to have to see if we can find a toilet. And we need to have a shink. Yeah, shower. That's what I was looking or a for. Shower, shower. Yeah. I'm gonna buy first. 
can see it's gonna make me have to figure out whether or not it's gonna fit. <laughs> hmm. It's a puzzle. So I have to see if it would actually work in here or not. Oh, so it looks like you could potentially work right there. You won't rotate any which way. All right, well, good enough. There you go. Okay, so we'll unscrew these caps. And we'll put our shower in here. Okay, now we'll buy the shower. Bathroom fixtures. Oh yeah, wait. The shower I wanted was right there, so I don't actually have to go all the way back. Yeah, that's gonna work out fine. Assemble. You'd think that would increase the value of the home significantly, having what, two and a half baths or whatever this is? Nothing. Well, this is going to be a full bath here. Yeah, well, the other one's a small one, though. Well, maybe they're not. Maybe they're full baths. See, I'm going to put... I'm going to put a toilet and a sink right in here, too. Yeah. And so... We can have a full bathroom here. Mm, installations? Or assembly, toilets. <laughs> Bye now. Avengers, assemble. Okay, um. Okay. Toilets. <laughs> That's wild, the sound of that makes. toilet there and I you can buy a toilet and mount it here well, let's just see if by happenstance I could put it over here instead I could I'd rather have it there I'd rather have the toilet there okay so we're gonna have to sell this mount for the toilet all right all right now we're going to go back to our hands and we're gonna pick our sink mount. All right, installation, or assembly, and now we gotta find the sink. Sink plumbing system. There we go. See, check it out. Much Everything better. is awesome. All right. Oh yeah, I don't have anything to unscrew on that one. I just have to unscrew here. Okay. Oh, I gotta go to the one that's highlighted. Uh -huh. It won't let me do it on my own terms. Okay. Simon says. <laughs> All right. So bathroom fixtures. Sinks. All right. Well, here's sinks and toilets. Well, let's see. The mom's got a thing with different like reds and greens. And gold. Yeah. So let's see what we can pick out with this toilet here. Let's make this... Let's do pink. We'll do pink. We could do that. Sure. We'll stick with pink. Oh yeah. <laughs> Toilets over here. You gonna tell me this toilet's too big and it's not gonna fit there? The uh, toilet mount is there. All right, fine. I'm going to have to go with a different size toilet. I know what I can handle. That was king size. <laughs> this is a little one here. Should work. Now you have to go with the commoner's size. Yeah. See, here's a little one right here. It'll fit right there. There you go. All right. It's cheaper anyhow. There. All right, close you again. Okay, so there's a little toilet. So we're going with the marble look, I guess. All right. All right. Now I gotta get the sink. Well, since I had to go with something different, maybe I can go with, let's see. Yeah, let's go with something like that. Let's see what color wood, the maple. 
a white wood. Um, let's see. Alright, um, yeah, we'll go with something like that. That'll be alright. <laughs> Assemble. Ah, you're gonna uh -huh. make a water mess. How dare you make a water mess? You're supposed to have the water turned off, Goofy. If you yeah. had the water turned off, this wouldn't be a problem. Okay, come on. Yeah, wouldn't her shoes have gone... Right? You would be thinking that... Look at that mess! Where's look the at that! I gotta clean it up right now. There we go. That's all clean. Bupkis. Oh, yeah. We don't even have lights in here. Do we uh -uh. even have a light switch? Yeah. Oh, there's a light like switch with no lights. Okay. Well, we need to get lights in here. You'll take your bath in a tomb. <laughs> you take your, your shower and your bathroom break in the dark. You yeah. don't get lights. Okay. So let's see here. Oh, let's go with ceiling lamps, I guess. Well, those are some funky lights. Let's go with disco fever. Hmm. Let's have a strobe light in the bath. <laughs> <laughs> well, they do have some pretty uh, crazy lights in here. I'm going to go with something simple. Hmm. You don't need a chandelier in the bathroom. <laughs> Yes, darling, it would simply go with the decor. <laughs> with a bathroom this small, I'm not so sure that we need to have that. We could go with something like this, maybe. Golden. Dark. Whatever gets the job done. Whites. Lights. Pastel rose. We don't need to fancy. Or black. Let's go with dark. the small side towards the shower all right let's see wow and we got some light it's not actually as much light as i thought it should be i kind of feel like it's still kind of claustrophobic in there eh. well that's not i have to have like two of those to make enough light in this bathroom yeah. all right we're not doing that we're gonna have to get something better i gotta get a uh, mirror in here too Let's try something like that. Maybe that'll even be better. Alright, we're selling you. I know that one's not straight in the middle, but I was just looking to see if we are any better luck. Oh yeah, that's way better luck. Yeah. Yeah, look at you! Oh! Stupid chandelier. <laughs> <laughs> it's definitely better. Much more comfortable. Okay. Now we gotta go for a mirror. All right. And I think it's in decorations and mirrors. Let's go with something like this, maybe. Oh, that's um, massive. <laughs> what a shocker. <laughs> Wow. I'm totally surprised. <laughs> that's that's uh, bigger than the shower <laughs> almost. There we go. See, something like this is still big, but it's at least better. Good grief. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Who's the fairest contractor oh. of them all? <laughs> there, is that more centered? I can't tell. Eh, it's good enough. Close enough for this kind of work. It is. Close enough for this work. All right, so this bathroom doesn't seem to fit in with the rest of the decor because everything else has got all these other colors. So let's go ahead and see if we can find some paint. So, or wall tiles. Let's, oh, look at that orange. That's awful bright. Okay, let's see here. We'll get some wall panels. No, I like wall tiles. Let's look at some wall tiles and see what we can come up with that's gonna be interesting. Oh, okay, well, how about, oh, look at that. 
Well, it doesn't have that color anywhere else in the house, but I think that would be okay. There's a light green, classic green, there's blue. Okay, dark green. All right. Let's see, that's red. That would make the room really small though. We're gonna go with this. This is my addition to the house. Okay. We're gonna go with these really bright ones. Okay. I don't know if I'm gonna need that many, but I'm getting prepared. I was prepared. <laughs> oh yeah, I like that better. It's gonna definitely bring a lot of more, a lot of more, a lot a wild, more. <laughs> wild sound effect, yeah. Probably should have waited to put the shower in until after I got the walls tiled. Ah, that marble doesn't actually look too bad. Maybe I can see if I can find like a marble floor. Ah, see now she's thinking. Oops, moved it. Doesn't look too bad. It'll brighten it up in here. Uh -huh. I don't like the white. It's boring. We lived in an apartment with all white for so long that I can't ever have white. Yeah. <laughs> There must no, be color in our no life. No more whites, anything and everything. Of course, white is the combination of all colors, isn't it? Um, I don't remember. I believe so. I know. On the spectrum, I believe white is the combination of all colors at once. I was thinking, was it is black the one the absorption of all colors and white is the reflection of all colors? I can't remember. Hmm. That's an excellent question definitely been a while. Hey, if you guys got an answer on that one, by all means, let us know. It's I believe that's the case. The Google. Probably worth the Google. <laughs> it probably is worth the Google. Sounds like a squeegee or something. It's, it's supposed to be putting tiles up. I'm having problems with one little section on this wall back here. Do I still have a... Oh, I just had it highlighted. Oh, I can do it without it. Let's say, do I still have a ladder someplace? Sometimes I have to buy a ladder for houses and then sell it because I can't take my ladder with me, which is a total bummer. That is. <laughs> what kind of a contractor are you? Apparently not one that's prepared enough to take a ladder with you. <laughs> Once I get to the really big houses, it'll be interesting. Yeah. It says you can buy scaffolding, and I was like, um, okay, well, if it comes to it, we will. <laughs> Take your little squeegee Wen uh, uh, Wingardian Leviosa. <laughs> Float it up there. Do a little Harry Potter magic. Reparo. <laughs> a pack of tiles would be useful. Oh my goodness. Could you imagine how awesome that would be in real life to go around? Reparo. Oh, that would be nice. That uh, would be a very nice addition. That would be awesome. Look at that! I have one tile to spare! Do I have everything tiled for really? I do! Look at that! Uh -huh. Alright! A to put my tile down and I will sell my one single tile left for $2.75! <laughs> Way to go! Look how nice! Doesn't that look better? Uh huh. Alright, doesn't quite match the rest of the house, but that's okay. It's my little addition. Alright, now I need to do floor. Floor and ceiling. We're just going to do floor. Ooh. I wonder if that's probably too much turquoise. Let's see if we can find some marble. If I can find something marbly, we'll go with that. If not, we're going to go back to that teal. Let's see here. Um, floor and ceiling tiles. Yeah, let's maybe narrow it down a little bit. Concrete. Well, we're not looking for concrete. Uh, no. We're looking for a marble print. Gray, white. Well, white's kind of boring. But, I mean, I guess I could do white. If we have to, we'll do white. 
ceramic tiles gray white swirls let's see what that looks like we'll try it I mean best case scenario we like it worst case scenario we don't hey I don't mind that <laughs> I think that's gonna be too bad. They sound like there's a um, porcelain tile. Well, I think it's supposed to be ceramic. Oh, really? Okay. Okay. Let's get out of that. Go back to the hand mode. Well, what do you think of that bathroom? I think it's pretty cool. Oops. I got what do you think, guys? Wall. I don't think that's too shabby. That's pretty nifty. Come over here and use the toilet if you need to, and yeah. get you a shower if you want, and then you Looking can. Looking good. Yahoo! Okay, so now we need... Under normal circumstances, I'd go hog wild in the bathroom. And I'd put all kinds of stuff in there. But we're not going to get that crazy. No, nah, we're getting ready to flip it. Yeah. But I do want to do just a couple little things. Um, bathroom, that's what I was looking for. Oh, they have toothbrushes and soaps and all kinds of stuff. Soap dish, brush. Look at that! I was just looking for some towels, folks. Yeah, something like that. You gotta have a hand towel right there by the sink so they can. They can dry their hands. You've got to have a hand towel right here by the sink. Uh -huh. So they can dry their hands on their way out. And then we got to get, let's see here. Oops, didn't mean to move that far. Um, yeah, we could get something like that. That would be all right for some bath towels. See what color we can go with. Well, I'm not sure. I like those colors. Hey, let's go find something else. Let's try looking at that one. Okay, see, some of these colors might not be so bad. Let's see. The floral shoots. Well, why why aren't they just plain old, just white? All right. Well, we can go with that. That's fine. We're not going to argue too much. We can handle this. So you're probably going to end up hitting yourself when you're coming back and forth. So let's put this above the toilet. So you just walk over by the toilet. Because as soon as you get out of that hot shower, you're going to get cold and then you're going to have to go pee anyway. So, so <laughs> <laughs> we'll put your towels right there. <laughs> and then we're going to get a little rug. Okay. And let's see if there's anything else we want for the bathroom. Oh my gosh. They got all kinds of stuff. Um, well, we need toilet paper holder. Pants. Oh, look at that! Used to be only gold, now they got silver. That makes more sense. Okay. So you gotta have some toilet paper right next to the toilet. All right. Now we need a rug and a little waste basket, and the bathroom's done. So we'll go with containers. Mm, oh, look! So it's got seashells on the. I wonder if there's any other colors. Oh, oh, you can change it. Look how awesome. <laughs> These are things that didn't used to be like that. Ah. Under the sea. Under I liked the sea. it. This one. Look how pretty with the different colors. Ah. Looky what she can do. Uh -huh. What color green is that? Eh, we're going to go with this one. Eh, we'll go with this one. Look at that. Oh, I like that. That works well. See, right there, next to the sink. Ta-da! Okay, now I need to get a rug. I'm trying to remember if it's under accessories or where we're looking. Mm, decorations. Accessories. 
occasional. I think it's just like holiday stuff. Yeah. Oh, well, I didn't mean to go all the way away. Let's see here. Floors and ceiling. I don't think that's it. I think it's just coverings. Okay, so like that's actual tile and stuff. Okay. Decorations, furniture. Let's see if it's in furniture. I thought there was a section for rugs. Wow, that is a fancy couch. Uh. I, that, that would be for like the castle, whenever we get to the castle. That's what that will be. We don't need cabinets. about to give up here. Floor! Found it! Took me a minute. Sorry. Oops. Aha! Uh -huh. Let's see what this is like. How small or big. Okay, so this is teeny tiny. So we'll put this one over here in front of the toilets. And then we're going to get a big one might want to get a little bit smaller for the other. Let's see what the medium size looks like. I mean, you're afraid to get large because, you know, our experience with that. Yeah. <laughs> but we might have to get large on this one. Yeah, large isn't too large. Large in this game is translation for slightly gigantic. <laughs> well, in this particular scenario, it's not actually. <laughs> Which is surprising because it's been that way every time. There. So you have a rug under your feet when you're standing at the sink. You get a rug when you step out of the shower, and you get a rug when you're on the toilet. There you go. All right. This bathroom is going to be done. This bathroom All is right. clear, man. So let's go downstairs. We're going to start at the basements. Uh, work our way through the house. And, and then, then we're we'll gonna... finish outside. Yes, we will. And then we'll flip this baby. All right. Here we go, guys. Oh, I'm stuck on the stairs. The walkthrough of the McAllister home. So we had to change the basement door. Yeah. And we moved around the bikes. And we put some skis. There's a hello, Kevin. Yep. <laughs> we got... I changed this out to like a tote for the basket because there was a basket there. Yeah. And you got your stuff. There's a bunch of miscellaneous junk that's usually down here. But yeah. we couldn't do that much. And there's the furnace. We put in a new panel because they had panel. Uh-huh. And... Then we're going to go into our kitchen. Shut up. The red curtains in the kitchen. <laughs> there's that fridge. Yes. There's the fridge. And then we got our drying rack and put lights underneath the cabinets and the gingerbread house and the old fashioned <laughs> TV and Where all we were watching the uh, Miracle on 34th Street. Yeah. And then we have the little flowers on her table. And we have the little bar stools around the, um, the, uh... Island. Island. Thank you. I was missing the words for a second. You were on an island. <laughs> my, my brain went to an island for a second. And there's a big old tree bush thing here in the kitchen. All right. This is their dining room. This is where a all the feathers and stuff. dining room. <laughs> an old game reference there. Um, so we have their little candelabras. We have some poinsettias. We did not get little angel figurines. Magical poinsettias for Christmas. <laughs> and then we have their gold stuff and the little hamster. It doesn't really go with it, but it was gold, so it worked. And, um, boy, I tell you, we did a lot of improvision, that's for sure. Uh-huh. Make our little plants match. This is cool. We had to add some stuff here and there to make that work. <laughs> a little plant I'm stuck on. The amazing pictures up the wall. Yes, no Vlad. No Vlad. I never had Vlad, although <laughs> I was accused of having Vlad. There we go. We had our Captain Kirk wall over there. Yes, we just had to go through our Captain Kirk wall. Uh -huh. And then the pianos here. And the excessive amount of nutcrackers that I thought was <laughs> absolutely hysterical to add. Even Obsessed though they, much? They did have nutcrackers, just not quite that many. And then their little presents around the tree. Oh, that's cool. 
And then I made their little game table, yeah. the little chessboard. Hey, where's the foosball table? Ah, they didn't have that. <laughs> Not that we saw. No, I just okay. can't. So this is this room. And look, you can see it's snowing outside. Oh, that's cool. We're all ready for Christmas. Hey, check it out. Old Man Marley. All right. And now we're heading up the stairs. We got our plants at the turn of the stairs. And we've got you our me with plants, more can, kid. plants in the hallway. We're going to go back to Kevin's room. It's not perfect, Kevin. but it's better. We shrunk his room down a little bit, so Jeff could, Jeff have, could have a room. There's the little girl's room. <laughs> Didn't put near as much stuff in here. Um, here's Buzz's room. <laughs> kind of just moves some stuff around no a little floating bit. Pen. No floating pen. Well, nope, it's hiding under the desk. There you go. So you can't even see that there was a pen that just didn't want to agree with us. There you go. We made Jeff's room. Uh-huh. All right. Here's the bathroom. Get out of here, you nosy little pervert. I'm going to slap you silly. <laughs> Uncle Frank. <laughs> <laughs> Here's the girls' room again. The other sister's room. And then, we're gonna go all the way through here. Here's the parents' bathroom. <laughs> Look how fancy fancy. Uh -huh. All right. And then, here's the parents' bedroom. We slept in. <laughs> Actually, you know, this probably could have moved over a little bit, but that's fine. We'll leave it be. And then their little window screen and all that stuff, the little TV. And <laughs> then they don't have an attic. I mean, this is the third floor. So this is the uh, a bathroom we created. This was an extra closet, but I think it looks better as a bathroom and it works better. If you especially yeah. you have 15 people in this house yeah, and you're the people. only one causing trouble. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we're going to go out through the back of the house. Through the doggy door. Yes, he's got a little doggy Where door. Where he lost his shoe. Yeah, and he stuck his head through. The little jerk is armed. <laughs> <laughs> they got their little fountain in the backyard. The plants that I can't plant, but yeah. they did have. The little bushes. All right. And this is to go down their basement stairs. It would like put the lamp where I wanted it. Yeah, so where he was trying to use the crowbar to get in. Yeah. He slipped and fell down the stairs. The trees that he cut one off, but I yeah. can't plant either. To make his little Christmas tree. And the little tire swing. We don't have room for a tree a house. A tree house? <laughs> He's got to call the cops from a tree house. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, come on, I got an idea. <laughs> and then they have a two car garage, and we don't have the ability to build so we a two car garage. We kind of made a makeshift one. So we kind of did a generic two shed yeah. side by side that kind of. Sort of resembles, resembles it, yeah. sort of represents the two-car garage. Yeah. Some more bushes that they're supposed to have. Yep. Around the front. We got the turnaround driveway here. And they got the little lights up front like they're supposed to. And we have a little gnome because we don't have, don't the, have the little jockey, jockey. guy. But hey, it's what it is. Yep. All right. We'll take our final peek here. <sighs> so uh, we've done our final walkthrough. Better sweet. All right, guys, the moment of truth. All, All right. right, let's do this. Right We're going to flip this thing. It's like almost, I don't know, how many? Okay, let's go back. I got to look. Six episodes. Nine, nine hours, seven yeah. minutes, 30 seconds. Oh, still my going. goodness. All right, guys. All right. Drum roll. Put the house on auction. Here we go. Oh, it's killing me. Let's see what. Put on auction. Ah. Oh, let's see what we get. You bought the house. Here. You bought the house. $437,374.27. Wow. All right. Your current budget is $108,713.42. Wow. You've been working on this house for nine hours, seven minutes, and 32 seconds. Wow. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Ah. Serious investment, guys. Oh, putting it on auction. Was it worth it? Oh, we're at 463, 467, 472, 474, 490, 559. All right. Okay. All right. All right. Can we okay. barter with him a little bit? Or um, your negotiating skill or whatever you have. Why to negotiate. Yeah, your perk. 
So let's uh, see. Try to get like the profit would be 114. So let's see if I can get like another 6,000. Make it 120. Or yeah, or 125. Maybe. Whoa, I don't want to go up by like 50,000. That wouldn't go well. So let's see if I can get um. Well. Do you like another five dollars or ten thousand? Keep what I kept doing. Would you say, sweetheart? Oh, okay. Go. If, yeah, it jumps up significantly. Yeah, it's kind of hard. Like I'm at nine thousand. What are you wanting? Oh, I just like if you do eleven, that would make a hundred and twenty-five thousand dollar profit. If you do eleven thousand. Okay, eleven thousand. Okay. Well, I don't know. Because do... if you try to ask. Eleven thousand one hundred ninety-eight. Okay. All right, 97, $11,197 more. Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> That's fine. All right, let's see. Hit Can we do this? I don't know. Will they take it? Negotiate, they're thinking, they're thinking. Your offer's too low. I can sell you the house for 11000 Good, we accept your proposal. $125,952.59. All right. Aha. We made quite a profit on that guy. We actually did get a profit. All right. Okay. We flipped it. All right, who bought it? All I didn't right. even see. Um, I did not see. Who was that masked man? The Johnson family. The Johnson, Johnson. family. All right, there Johnson. There must be a decent kitchen in the house. There's you no just big got, family You just room. bought yourself the home alone home. All right. <laughs> Accept the offer. All right. All that time. Yeah, goodbye. This is no damaged wall. It's beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> now uh, we're going back. Yeah, back to the office. That was All right, guys. Work. That was a lot of fun. We hope you enjoyed this through the holidays and post. We really appreciate you being with us through this journey of remodeling and flipping the McAllister home. If you enjoyed this and you want to see us move on to the next Home Alone home or uh, next thing we're going to do, <laughs> we'll be on the moon or who knows where we'll be. The next house we're going to try to take on. It's up to you guys. If you want to see this continue, thumbs up this video. Let us know in the comments whether you enjoyed this series and you enjoy House Flipper. We really appreciate hearing from you. It brings a smile to our face. If you like this, like I said, thumbs up the video. Consider subscribing to the YouTube channel on Poetically Christian and hit that bell icon and you'll be notified the next time this Christian couple makes a video on this channel. And if you're watching us over on Poetically Christian Gamer Twitch, remember to hit that follow button and you'll be able to follow this Christian couple when we are live the next time. Remember what we talked about today, guys? Yes, and this... House flipper trying to flip this house. What mattered most is how much material things you could put into it and how much they valued it. That in our Christian life, God's word tells us that we are to value the exact opposite in Colossians 3, 2. To set our affections on things above and not on things of the earth. Is God what we love? Is it above? Is he above everything in our life? Is he what matters most? More than anything on this earth. Because if he is... We're on the right track, guys, and our love is rightly placed. With that being said, guys, we thank you so much for joining us, and we hope you enjoyed the Home Alone Home. Till the next one, guys, bless wishes. Bye. See you later, guys.